Hi guys, my name is LA with the Center for Individuals with Physical Challenges and for our sports virtual video today we'll be watching a wheelchair softball game. So this video is from Nationals, I believe it's 2013. It's around an hour 20 minutes long and uh, we're not expecting you to watch that full video but we do want you to watch uh, as much of the game as you can to watch our three key takeaways and our three key takeaways from the video are batting, fielding, and throwing the ball. So I'll leave a description under this video um, to be more specific on what we're looking for but I'll just go down the list right now. Um, so with the first thing batting everybody bats differently a lot of people bat one-handed um, and a lot of people bat with two hands so with batting with one hand um, I'm using this golf club as an example because I don't have a bat right now so with batting with one hand a lot of people um, use their their front hand to bat and then with their back hand the rear hand they're using it to roll into the actual ball before they swing or they'll use it to push and get a head start on that pushing after the ball contacts the bat so either way it works um, we'll work more as we practice you can try some at home but if you're batting one-handed usually that offhand is used to prepare to get the first base or it's used to help you getting some power for that um, for that swing um, with two hands um, just a normal two-handed swing everybody's mobility is different so just batting um, with two hands as soon as you hit the ball whether you're batting one-handed or two hands you're going to make sure you're dropping that bat out to your left where you're not going to run the bat over because a lot of our lefties i believe our lefties are when they're batting to the right the um just going into your path between home and first base so remember um always drop the bat to where you have a clear path uh, to get to first base now with the fielding as you watch the video um the ball goes many um, different places uh, and everybody fields it differently so if you have a stronger side that you feel better feel like if you're right-handed you want to try to get that ball on your right side but um don't force it to where you, it's a bad play or you'll end up fumbling the ball there's my dog zeke right there so with fielding um get to your best side or comfortable side if not then adapt and make the play so watch how they um go to the ball and use their right hand left hand or both hands to lean down and pick up the ball um, watch how they attack the ball a lot of them do not sit and wait for the ball to come to them they're going to attack the ball and then for our third phase the third thing we're focusing on is throwing the ball so watch the transition from how they pick up the ball turn their chair and their body to whatever whatever player or base they want to throw the ball to so they're rolling they're attacking the ball picking it up right hand left hand or both hands and then turning their chair, turning the body, and delivering a throw. Now with the throw, you need to know your teammates because not all of us have the same abilities. So you need to uh, make that throw based on who you're throwing the ball to because not everybody can catch a hard pass um, or a wild pass. So really focus on making a good throw. So while you're watching this video, it's mainly for visualizing yourself out there making those plays. So we're gonna train through uh, watching those players compete. So um, during the video, if you have a question on a play or a question on how to do something, write that in the comments below. If you like the play, go ahead and um, write which play you liked in the comments below. So this video will go to our YouTube channel and our Center Members Facebook page as well. Uh, once again, my name is LA with the Center for Individuals with Physical Challenges, and this is our virtual video for today.